are new details in the investigation into a shooting in Lynchburg, and it's taken kind of a weird twist. It turns out the woman shot and injured by a police officer during a confrontation yesterday was the same woman shot by officers in an incident four months ago. WFXR's Anna McDougall has the story. I've been shot twice by the Lynchburg police, twice. Back in May, police were called to the James Crossing Apartments after a Child Protective Services worker was attacked. When officers got to Neely's door, they say she began attacking them with knives, which is when the officer shot her. According to Virginia State Police, yesterday morning just after 9 a.m., Lynchburg police went to the 2100 block of Park Avenue for reports of an assault. Officers got there and found Ashley Neely sitting at the bus stop. They say she was agitated, and when police tried to calm her down, she reached for a knife and came at the officers. One officer used a taser, while the other fired a gun, hitting Neely once. I seen her laying on the ground. After that, I just started running. Ashley Neely has been charged with one felony count of assault on a law enforcement officer, one misdemeanor count of assault, and one felony count of escape. VSP says the escape charge is because Neely did not go to jail after being released from a mental health facility after the first incident in May, as the court had told her to do. Virginia State Police says this is an ongoing investigation and that one officer has been put on limited duty until the end of the investigation. They tell us Neely's injuries are non-life threatening. That was Anna McDougall reporting. This is a story we will continue to follow closely when we're not on the air. You can look for updates on our website, WFXRTV.com.